Hello everyone, welcome to a new episode of Horizon Zero Dawn with Aloy! So, we gotta go... Well... <laughs> to some place really far. Gaia Prime, I think he was. So let's go here. <gasps> I cannot fast travel. Why the fuck not? Why can I not fast travel? Oh, now I can! What the hell? The way to the mountain will be hard. Ferocious machines prowl every step of the climb. More corrupted. Not corrupted. But they will not tolerate humans. So what else is new? Hmm. I've been here before to collect something. So... Yeah, Hold on, Eloy. Right. But I can get through this. Now I know what they're guarding. Yeah, I have the birds here. Hey, uh, shush. Um, what the fuck, man? Look at this. Been in here before. To a point. You'll see. Okay. From now on, I'll be also searching for the power cell. I don't see it yet, so let's go forward. You made a climbing path for me, but left an army of machines for me to deal with? Since when were machines any obstacle for you? If you could fly, I wouldn't have bothered with a climbing path either. What the hell, man? Ah, oh, this guy's such a dick. This is exactly the kind of place I expected to find you in silence. Thank you. It's one of many workshops I've constructed over the years. You built this? What for, idiot? What the? Can I, no, I can't scan him. There'll be enough time later for you to ransack this place. Okay, asshole. For years, I tried to get through this hatch. I drilled, I burned, I blasted. But we both know that you won't have any trouble getting through. You make it sound like I should apologize. <laughs> it never occurred to me that the way through would not be with force, but with a key. A key in human form. The failure of imagination was mine, not yours. Looks like you've spent a lot of time here. Nineteen years ago, a great explosion destroyed this mountain. Gaia's death, your birth. The echo could be heard as far as the claim. Ash darkened the skies. How they fretted in meridian as they came. The crater burned for weeks, but when it cooled, I was the first to behold what lay within. Over time, the machines closed ranks to protect it. Useful. Soon, no one dared to come here. Except me. In her message, Gaia said we could restore her, but... After seeing the damage, how could that be? She said any effort to repair her must come after Hades is destroyed. I concur. Rebuilding the terraforming system now might allow Hades to use it as a weapon. Because of Gaia's sacrifice, it has been forced to search for means that are less... ...convenient. But... do you think it's even possible to restore Gaia? 
you know what the cauldrons are capable of. How they fabricate any technology necessary to create a machine. And by the same principle, it should be possible to replicate every technology necessary to repair Gaia. But that would take years. And we're counting the time we have left by the hour. But what I understood is that those facilities were controlled by Gaia itself or herself uh, uh, whatever whatever you want to you want to say um, so I'm not sure how we would be able to do it because even if Aloy is somewhat of a clone of Elizabeth doesn't have the knowledge in robotics in technology and so on to create something new like to create a new machine to create a new like to build a new system, you know, so I'm not sure how, how that would happen if Gaia is indeed destroyed. Because in the message it said that she would self-destruct, so... I thought you might actually be here this time. Actually, here. Why? My presence is unnecessary. You don't need my help to pass through this door. You were the one born to do this, not me. It's time for me to head in. Yes. When you find the Master Override, you will gain the power to defeat Hades. Everything depends on you. Like always. Turn right. I'm going straight ahead. Logging arrivals. Shan Margo. Welcome to Frozen Hell. Population 10. 11 counting Gaia. Don't count your chicken embryos before they're incubated, hon. She's still firing up. Be a while before you eat that omelet. I'm vegan, Travis. You think we'd worked in the same secret base long enough for you to notice? We weren't scheduled to shack up here for another three weeks. You realize I just lost 350 kilos of pre-code smug comics in transit. Wait, actual physical media? Why didn't you have it digitized? Can't beat the feel of physical media on your fingers. And in here, we ain't gonna be touching a whole lot else. Figured I was gonna pass the time archiving them. What about you? Me? Up work, I guess. My task queue stretches out for, like, three years. There's a lot of sharp edges to round off. After that, I hadn't really thought about it. Oh, you will. You're what, 30? Rick, can you be the one turning the lights off at the end? Food for thought, huh, vegan? This sucks forever. Nah, not forever. Just the rest of your life. What's the difference between forever and the rest of your lives, really? You know? The hell? Mind your footing. Why are you vibrating, controller? Why? Something's up, man. Nope, I haven't skipped it yet. Okay, Aloy, calm down. We're there. That's my way across. Okay. In that case, let's explore the other side. Oh, 
Oh. Wait, what? Let's go. It must fit somewhere. Let's go. Let's go. Thank goodness I noticed that. Oh my gosh. Ah. You're fine. Boom. I got all of them. Let's fucking go. I also need to go to the restroom. Shit. Don't think you boy. Just do it. I couldn't have said it better myself. What? Oh. Oh, glad that's over. Alright, guys. Whoa! Aloy, calm down. I'm back. This. Okay. Let me just see. Still really cool. Okay. these ropes okay oh baby let's go Margot Shen record I just woke up it's I see the numbers but can't make up the time I was dreaming of uh, I was giving a lecture in Q hall maybe it was something more Shamanistic, I, I don't know. An audience of shadowy faces under a blank open sky. I told them the world ended with a bang. A plague of robots. The last humans. We went asper. You know, in caves. Ending like we started huddled around a flickering glow. The heads of state, the Fortune Fives, the leaders and lottery winners and life cults. All of them buried in their little shelters. Some believing they'll live it out some way, somehow, or Elysium, or us here at Gaia Prime. No different. A multitude of tiny societies taking hold, flaring, dying. Some will be beautiful, some horrific. None of them matter. Short-term civilizations. One last gasp. One last gasp for the long-held breath. Before I wake up, I know the audience is gone. I'm talking to myself, to a quiet planet, a barren sphere. Just Gaia and her long, long dreaming. I hope she won't be lonely. My god. The line of one last gasp before the long held something. I can't remember what she said, but like, wow. Never heard anyone describe death like that. Evacuation happens so fast. No time to think things through. No time for goodbyes. There were lines in the medical ward. I told Tom Paik I'd be with him when he went under. But there was one last shipment of parody Sadie Zygos I could get processed if I rushed. I'm still angry at him for forcing me to choose. Angry at myself for... Well, he died alone. And I didn't get the bloody birds of paradise saved either. All the time left in the world now to think. Gaia Prime's locks are sealed. 
Elysium, sealed up, safe and sound. A distance of miles, but it might as well be on the other side of the galaxy. All the beaters and gammas and support staff living their lives. If I hadn't been an alpha, if things had gone differently, I could have been there. Instead, I'm spending the rest of my unnatural life in here with people I don't even like. And without the one, I would have gladly spent my life with. Given a chance. Two hours since I signed off on the final executables and I'm already a bitter old man bitching to his focus. There's a thought for future shit. Elizabeth oh Taylor. shit. I know it. She didn't even get a chance to unpack. These are her journals. The, the focus can rebuild them, but the process is slow. To us it seems a powerful device, but its engine is tiny and limited. How slow? Days, weeks, years. Concern yourself with stopping Hades and extending the future, and you might live long enough to hear them. This is Charles Rodson. I'm logging this six hours after final deployment of Gaia Prime. This morning, an access port seal malfunctioned. Gaia Prime's port seals were designed to close with a seam of less than two millimeters. But this one closed with a 10 millimeter gap. Enough for an energy to detect this facility. Enough for Gaia to be discovered and destroyed. Enough to end the future we worked so hard to make possible. Unless the hatch servos were manually re-engaged from the outside. I'm now switching to a recording of the event. Well, I'm not going out there. Now, who has signed up for? Either we sent someone out, or all of this was for nothing. It should be Liz's decision. So when is she going to get here? She said five minutes. You don't think... Oh, no. Okay, everyone. I've repaired the seal. Gaia? Seal closure at 1.4 millimeters. Confirmed. Elizabeth, no. We'll find a way to bring you back in. It's not gonna happen. The swarm's too close. Really. It's all right. Guy's complete. She'll take care of things from here on out. That's what she does. Not like this. There's so much we- Guys, you know me. I'm... I'm no good endings. At letting things end, so, um... Let's not. So... Happy trails, Liz. And, uh... See you around. Yeah. Take care of each other, all right? Liz. Different perspectives. 
no one could keep up with you, live up to you. I, I don't know, maybe if, if, I, if I hadn't taken that postdoc in Joburg... In the end, I don't think I could have taken seeing another one of you. I mean... Elizabeth Sobek... There's only one. I miss you. Okay, um, I'm gonna listen to the others, uh, but I need to make any recordings, so just give me a second. Alright guys, so new recording is ready, let's listen to this now. Travis, the idiot. Look, Liz, you are a pretty stand-up gal. I'm sorry you died. If you had a home to go to, I hope you got there first. But this... Monument Ronson's made to you? Kinda creepy if you ask me. Rest in peace, Liz. God knows you earned it. Was Ronson her, like, her boyfriend? Hell, Liz. I know. I know you're never gonna hear this. That's not the point. You, uh... <laughs> He got to play the savior in the motor all at once this time. Great work. That's all? Wow. What a dickhead. Um... Oh. These are roses. These are flowers. Oh, this is like a grave. I get it. I get it now. Okay. I'm so stupid. Hey, Lord. She's gone. Really gone. You knew she couldn't have survived, Eloy. And her achievements were... beyond exceptional. While her people bickered, she was the one, the only one who could. She was better than them. That's not what I said. She was. You shouldn't be afraid to admit it. I fucking hate this guy. You think she was better because she was smart. Because she designed Zero Dawn, but you missed the point. What made her great was that she was willing to sacrifice herself. For others. For everyone who would come later. No. She couldn't let her creation fail. You're confusing will for sentimentality. You're wrong. Remember, she knew it wasn't enough for Gaia to think. She taught Gaia to feel. To care, to sacrifice, to believe in life. Enough to fight against hopelessness. If it wasn't for that sentimentality, life would have ended. You and I would never have existed. Your argument is sound. I'm sorry for your... loss. She said she wanted to go home. Maybe. What? Nothing. It's time to go on. <clears throat> Hello, Margo. Uh, How are you holding up? Uh, Dr. Ronson, I've been getting a lot of messages, unsolicited messages from Ted. Oh, I'm sorry. With Liz... gone, we've got no one to run interference with him. I'll talk to Ted. He mostly wants updates. Constant updates. Hundreds of updates on things he knows nothing about. Liz used to field all of his crap. He doesn't understand the systems at all. I was kind of by design. But he's getting pretty sketchy with me. We just have to keep him happy. Liz always said, keep him happy. Are you kidding? You ever hear how she talked to him? <laughs> she was managing him, Margo. I mean, maybe I should ignore him. He's buried in this pyramid with the Hola Hola girls and Panta Antimon Cuckoos. What can he do? Uh... 
Do I want to know what she was talking about? Maybe not. Maybe not. you have for me game all right let's start uh, over from Eleuthia one running integrity tests dr. Uh, Brochard Klein may I seek outside protocol I suppose so there's no one to stop you. Doctor, you are fatigued. You have been logging abnormal sleep cycles. Are you suffering from depression? Well, I am trapped in a science facility for the rest of my life. How about you? In a time slice of a quadrillion operating cycles, 10,000 are involved with processing the loss of Dr. Sobek. I have considered quarantining these processes. Do you think that would be wise? I'm not a psychologist, Gaia, or, or an AI scientist. I... no. It is... natural. At least in the context of the work you and I have accomplished, which begs the meaning of the term natural. She was your creator, the patron saint of this crazy endeavor, our lady of the fervent hypothetical. Even assuming a string of zero dawns, chances of success are greater than the hypothetical. Hmm. It's called a manner of speech, Gaia. Take a note. Okay. What are we gonna plug into their heads, Les? A whole lot of history? A whole lot of so-called truth? A whole lot of noise? It's not pablum, Les. It's poison. Because it was armored, you found the control room. I'm on my way. Good job, honey. It's vibrating the hell out of my controller. Wait, yay, yeah, yay, yeah, don't do that, babe. I don't think I'm supposed to go there. I mean, mm, no way. I've, I've been taking a hard look at the project. In the end, it's simple. It's clean. It's clear. Erasure. Addition by subtraction. I can make it better, list. With a single stroke, make it all go away. I really don't like the direction this is going. Continue. Is, is this guy... What the fuck, you maniac? What? Like, he really thought of himself that he could do better than Sobek? Are you fucking kidding me, you fucking piece of shit? This fucking guy. This fucking guy. Man, if he wasn't already dead, I would've wanted to kill him. I'm so upset. Okay. Did you see that? Oh. You made it. You made it. You made it. It's alright. It's alright. Why am I... Here again. Why am I repeating? 
What did I miss? I've been here. What did I miss? I'm serious. Where did I go wrong? Where do you want me to go? He wants me to go up there. Oh, honey, come on, don't scare me like that. I didn't see this. I did not see that. Wow. Sorry, everyone. Oof, oof. I'm so sorry. When I opened the hatch, the air rushed in from this side. Because there was none inside the chamber. But the alphas were in there. Come on, Aloy. Aloy, baby, come on. I'm locked out of core control. Alpha clearance overridden. What the hell is o- Sorry to alarm you, but I need you to listen, okay? to what I'm about to say. This isn't easy. See, uh, <clears throat> I've, uh, please, stop trying to access the sense system, okay? See, see, what this is about is, um, I said stop trying to access the goddamn system. And what, what I'm trying to say is I can't stop thinking about the ones who'll come after us. Those innocents. Those blameless men and, 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 and women. We're gonna give them knowledge? Like it's a gift? Ted, Ted, we've talked about this before. Apollo has 3,000 plus failsafe conditions. It's not a gift, it's a disease. They're the cure, and we're gonna give them the disease. Our disease? No, we can't. And it's not too late. If we're willing to sacrifice. Ted. It doesn't need to be like this. It already is, Samina. I did it three minutes ago. I've purged Apollo. It's gone. All of it. Every copy. A sacrifice? It's not a sacrifice. It's cultural obliteration, you crazy bastard. Millennia of culture. I'm sorry. Really, I am. But sometimes, to protect innocence, innocents have to die. Emergency alert. That explains why... Yes? Okay. Like, it makes sense as to why no one, no one has any idea about what the old ones were and what happened to cause their extinction and whatnot. He... He killed them all. So this is why. This is why we were trapped in benighted ignorance for an innocent future. Blameless men. He never saw the slaughter in the sun ring. Everything these people achieved, all the knowledge of the old ones, he 
evaporated, turned to dust, scattered to the void, like the Alphas themselves. No, not a void. When the hatch unsealed and scattered their ashes on the wind, it took them out among the world they made, the world we're living in. It's, it's a monument to what they died trying to accomplish. A monument to oblivion. Not oblivion, silence. Hope. This silence is an idiot, is a moron. A feckin' moron. And this, this Ted guy, oh my god, like, his greed, his thirst for power is, is such a stupid fucking dumbass, selfish, egotistical piece of fuck. God damn. Override. That's so small. Now all you have to do is kill Hades with it. Oh! Oh god. Try not to fall to your death. The master override doesn't override gravity. Go. I think I owe it to you to tell you the rest of the story. Go on. Some time ago, I admitted that I'd been involved with the Eclipse. But I never told you the full extent of my culpability. The truth is, I was there at the beginning. I found Hades Aloy, buried on that mountain, trapped in that shattered titan. And I served it. What? Obvious. It promised knowledge and delivered such knowledge. You have no idea. And in exchange? I helped create the Eclipse. Helped it build a cult, an army to do its will. Why are you telling me this now? Because your success depends on knowing this. When I found Hades, the first thing it wanted to know about was the Spire. Not Meridian. The Spire. Now why would that be? Spire was created by Gaia. Which part of Gaia? M Minerva. It's code-breaking module. Gaia built spires to transmit the codes that deactivated the Pharaoh robots, shut down their biomatter conversion systems. Hades wants to send a new transmission to wake the machines so they can devour the world all over again. Yes. Based on what we've learned, that's my conclusion as well. They're just a means to an end. An army to capture the Spire. Yes. So Hades can exterminate life all over again. Unless you stop it. I want you to tell me everything. Hades, the Eclipse. Everything. It's a long story, Aloy. Then get started. It began with a focus. Recovered from an ancient ruin, as yours was so many years ago. In my case, the device was heavily damaged. There was just a flicker of life in it. I spent weeks studying it, attempting repairs, until finally, I succeeded. A whole new dimension of perception revealed, right before my eyes. That's when I detected it. A faint signal. Out there, something was searching, just like I was. A real kindred spirit. I followed the signal to its source. A shattered titan, buried in the jungles of the jewel. So you thought it was a titan? An old war machine? I didn't know what to think. I'd seen such wreckage before. The Grave Horde, for example. But this was different. This was not quite dead. It couldn't speak when I found it, until my repairs gave it a voice. So began an exchange of knowledge, its tribes and machines. But the Spire was always its foremost concern. 
What did it want to know about the spire? Its precise location. The surrounding geography. Who controlled the land. Meanwhile, Hades revealed to me many of the intricacies of ancient technology. It bid me to recover and repair more focuses. Before long, I had a couple dozen up and running. Enough to equip a small army. The commanders of one, anyway. I didn't care. I was learning so much. Physics, calculus. You have no idea. And the Shadow Karja? How did they become involved? The Karja Civil War was a happy coincidence. A perfect opportunity. <laughs> An opportunity? That's what it was to you? Yes. Overnight, half the tribe was in exile, desperate to win back Holy Meridian. Their religion made them easy to manipulate. All I had to do was present Hades as the buried shadow of their mythology. So yes, it was an opportunity. I arranged for High Priest Bahavas to meet with Hades. Helis was there as well. And so the Eclipse was born. Anything to win back Holy Meridian. But Hades didn't care about Meridian. And neither did you. We what were a few more. Besides, I was too busy setting up the cult's focus network to Hades' specifications. A thrilling technical challenge. Especially with the alterations I included of my own design. The ability for you to spy on them. Yes. I may have been foolish enough to serve Hades, but I was never so foolish that I trusted it. I installed what the ancients used to call a back door in the network. Secret access, empowering me to monitor all activity and communications. What made you turn on Hades? It certainly wasn't your conscience. Actually, I was troubled the first time I saw the Eclipse raise an ancient war robot with my technology. I questioned Hades about its intentions. A little late. Indeed. I'd already outlived my usefulness. When I completed work on the Focus Network, Hades summoned me to receive my reward. The next moment, I heard it broadcast my kill order. I've been a fugitive ever since. So when did I come into this? Our path together? When Olin stumbled on you. System threat detected. That got my attention. A kill order against a savage Nora girl? Why would Hades bother with that? But then I saw that this Nora girl was wearing a focus and bore an uncanny res- Helis moved quickly. I thought you were dead. But then I detected your focus inside the Nora mountain. The more I observed you, the more convinced I became of your extraordinary nature and usefulness. Through you, I could finally discover the secrets of the Earth. I vowed to do everything I could to ensure your success. The rest, as they used to say, is history. No. The things you've done in the pursuit of knowledge, Silence. Pure recklessness. I hate him. Aloy, this wasn't a confession to elicit your judgment. I don't give a damn. Unbelievable. I've done all I can. From here on out, the rest is up to you. Take my lance. Fit the master override to it, and you have a means of injection. Then I just need to get close enough to Hades' skull to stab it in? Exactly. Oh, no problem. Silence! Where will you go? Elsewhere. And everywhere. There's so much more to discover before the world ends. And all this? I leave it to you, of course. As it turned out, it was yours all along. I hate this guy. I hate this guy so much. They're coming. Preparations are complete. 
complete. Ah, Lucent Bahamas. Behold, as I promised you. What? Manner of great machine is this? I've never seen such a thing. Stay! Stay your ground, Karcha in shadow! Incorrect. Bow before the buried shadow. The buried shadow? I... I don't understand. Did Aramon understand the Glint Hawk that perched upon the Alight? It speaks scripture. Aramon followed the shadow cast from the Spire. To the Mesa, where Holy Meridian was founded. You will follow the shadow once more. I am a righteous man. Chosen of the Sun. But in times of need, the powers of Shadow can accomplish what the Sun alone cannot. Will... Will you return? An army is required. Obey, and Meridian is yours. Of our obedience, you can be certain. Piece of shit, this fucking guy. I traveled far to find you. I heard your transmission. It was you, wasn't it? Entity is not known. I'm called Silence. And you are. I don't think you'd have called out if it wasn't something you wanted. You called, I responded. Will you tell me your name? Hades. You are a creation of the ancients. A war machine. Divine timeline. Time? Ah. It is the 13th king of the Karja Sundom's reign. Divine Karja. We're getting ahead of ourselves. Were you created by the ancients? I wonder how long you waited here, buried, until I chanced upon you. How long you'd have to wait for another. You're obviously very powerful. But you're not going to get anywhere without me. Titan Flame merely houses intellect. Define Karja. Now that's more like it. The fuck, man. Task is complete. Yes. The focus network is active, built to your specifications. But I remind you of the reward you've been withholding. Quantum processing. Data has been compiled. Volume too great for transfer. How inconvenient for me. Come before me. You shall receive your reward. Very well. Fearless. Threat detected inside Eclipse. Speak its name, O Shadow, and it will die. You will eliminate this one. Silence. Silence. Yes. A truth whispered at night is seen in the day. He was never one of us. It will be done. Shadow. Okay. Ah. This was a lot. Um. I want silence off everything. Like, get the fuck out of my. What, what's it called? Focus. Get, get the fuck out of my life. Get the fuck out of everything. Go fuck yourself. I'm really disgusted with him anyways uh i'm gonna end the episode here thank you so much for watching i really appreciate it and i'll see you soon